What's up, kid? Too technical. I'm back again with another video. I said I'm back again with another video. So today, I have my Nothing Phone One, as you can see. I don't know how well you can see that, but I have the Nothing Phone One, and we're gonna do pros and cons. So first, let's do the pros. Let's do things I like about the Nothing Phone One. So I like that this is something different I like that this is a different device that you can go pick up if you don't mind importing it into the United States of America I was able to get this device on the beta program and I only paid $2.99 for this device so that was a sweet deal and I just I like I like how it feels overall it doesn't feel too light doesn't feel too heavy and of course I love the back of it that is just different all over that's just the different look as you can see no other phone out there has a back like this right now so that is another cool thing and then I like the software that's on top of here this is running Android 13 software but it's running with the, the uh, nothing's uh, software on top of it when I mean nothing software I'm talking about how you see everything like with the uh like with the time it is a dot pattern I really like that and then when you go into your weather you get that dot pattern I really 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 enjoy that it's something different you know this is a device that when you're out and about this device will turn heads you know I took it out and about and people are like ma'am what kind of device is that you know they think it's an iPhone and then when I show them they're like that's an Android device I'm like yes it is and then I do like the fact that it does have access to lift effect on the back because that's another different thing about this device that no other devices no other devices really doing with the glyphs that is really really cool overall I do like like I said how it feels uh, I do like the boxier look I do even though this may give you iPhone vibes but it, it, it works it works on this device it works so this is basically who running stock Android but with uh, Android 13 running on top of it and I like that because this device is very smooth and it's snappy and I like how up top it does the notifications up top that you use that you have for your Wi-Fi and for your uh, Bluetooth I like that then I also like how down here at the bottom here if you want to move a folder onto the home screen you can do that but it also gives you access to uh enlarge that folder i really like that look that is very unique and different to me i never had a device like this that can do that overall i do like this device and i have been enjoying this device but you know there's there's things that come with it when you like it then there's things that you don't like about it so now let's get into the cons the first con that i do not really care for about this nothing phone one is the size i wish this had a bigger display so hopefully when they come out with the nothing phone 2 hopefully they'll give this a bigger display because it's a cute it's a nice little phone but i like big phones and this that's a this this is the main reason why i don't really just use this as a secondary device every now and then i will but it just feels weird it feels weird because i'm always used to carrying big devices another thing is i do not like the placement of the camera i wish it was in the middle this kind of looks weird to me with having a punch hole with having a punch hole notch over here i wish it was in the middle like a lot of other smartphones do with their camera another thing i don't like is the glyph I, I know I said I do like that I do like the feature I do like that they put a glyph effect in there because this has a see-through back and you can see it I wish you could change the color you know I wish you wasn't just stuck with white I wish you can have different kind of colors LED colors when the phone rings like maybe if you miss the call maybe it can be red 
if you, somebody's calling you, you know, you can set certain colors to different notifications. So I wish it was a little bit more customization when it came to the lift LED lights in the back of the device. And pretty much those, that's pretty much my likes and dislikes on the Nothing Phone 1. I really have more likes than dislikes because this is something different, something new. And if you know me, I'm a different person. I like to be different. And with this device, there is no one else walking around where I live with this device. And I know that for a fact. Uh, then this is what your, uh, uh, your always on display was. Oh, that's another thing I don't like. I wish the always on display would be a little bit more customizable. I don't know if that's something they want to do. Or is that something they're thinking about when they come out with the nothing phone too. But I need some more customizations on it's not on the uh, always on display on the nothing phone too. I hope you found this video helpful. Let me know your thoughts if you do have a nothing phone one or if you're planning on getting one. So just rate, comment, and subscribe to this YouTube tech channel and I'll catch you in the next video. I'm out.